to the home of the dopest entertainment commentary. It's a brand new week. I don't know how was your weekend. And if you've not yet subscribed, come on, subscribe. And be part of the coolest gang ever. Hit notifications so that you don't miss when we post a club. And let's get into the dips. Here we go. Sari Podcast, brewing entertainment, honey. Entertainment industry can be a bit of a bore, but then there are times when it's just like news story after story after story after story, and it's like, okay, okay, we'll hear from me, okay, I see what she's doing. So, this babe, book Brenda Jones, <laughs> takes to her line, and the babe breaks down. And now she was there, she called out her lover, and you know, okay, so, so now Brenda Jones pictured here. Um, I don't know how to qualify this hand. Maybe she's a comedian. Maybe she identifies as a rape survivor. Maybe she identifies as a feminist, an activist. I don't know, but I just know of her from her jokes. Like she, she's those people who you know the skits and the what that she usually makes. I usually at, at some point I used to find them funny. So anywho, she goes up and she tells us that guys, by the way, in case you did not get the memo. The last time she did a live stream and she said that she could very well smash Michelle Ntalami because Michelle Ntalami is giving and then guys were like, we already know you're lesbian, so just come out and confess. Confess and leave when uh, Brenda Jones, confess and leave that you're lesbian instead of you. If you have something to say, say it instead of beating about the bush. So anywho, uh, she comes out and she says that my partner, okay, now this is the partner, this is her partner. Cheated on me with the one Foina Tosha. So Foina Tosha teacher here. And you guys remember, like Foina Tosha was the same one who guys were alleging that she might just be the actual cause of Annelisa Mugai going on this rave or this this anger burst that she had at some point. So Foina, I don't know, I don't know. She looks so quiet, but I think once you dig deeper, and guys were actually there's a time by the they were saying Foina and who was this other hand that they are dating? There was that rumor that was circulated in 2019, if I'm not mistaken. 2019, 2020. And guys are like, is lesbian. We all know allegedly that she's lesbian. So, anyway, uh, Brenda Jones comes out. She is crying. This girl is in, in pain. She is torn. And she goes on this <laughs> Instagram rant. Like, just puts out chance out stories, stories, stories. Crying her poor heart out, saying that you know whatever, when you never that babe and Foina did to me was not right, and this is what she had to say on her story. So watch the meltdown, and then later I think she was like, you know what, whatever I said when she went live, whatever I said on that live stream, I was drunk as fuck. I, you know, but everything that I said there, I meant it, and I'm standing by my truth. So just watch the new stories, and then let's come back and talk. <laughs> Bitchy, you are a bitch. Foina. Foina beauty. Foina beauty. I'm addressing you for a beauty. I'm addressing you for a beauty. You are a bitch. For a beauty, you're a bitch. I tell you, I'm a semi when you're a bitch. For a beauty, when you're a umbu. When you're a umbu. She's a tiny kubu. You're a sour. You're a sour too. You're a sour. You're a sour. You're a sour. You're a sour. It's fine. For in a minute, 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 I believe. Hi, for in a I trusted you. For in a I loved you as a friend. Even her exes are telling me she's a fucking whore. My God, she is a whore. But that's the truth. I'm not scared to say it. For you, I'm not saying that. Now, at the ex, we have the ex. We have for you, we have visited. I can't remember. Demi, I'm a jealous. Who did for you? I'm a jealous. 
Lakini hii ni kampuni ya live demu yangu ni ile mtu kudeti wasisema. Anataka kudeti wasisema kwa na jina. Ana demu mtoko na jina, anaona uwa akimwe akimwe like aki kosheka and the next famous person. I'm an influential woman. If anyone is asking if I'm okay, guy, I'm not okay. I'm hurting so bad. My heart is bleeding. I'm just feeling so heartbroken. Gosh. If anyone is asking if I'm okay, guy, I'm not okay. I'm hurting so bad. My heart is bleeding. I'm just feeling so heartbroken. Gosh. If anyone is asking, I'm breaking to the core. I am just so broken. Why would someone do this to me? Why? Why would someone do this to me? Guys, I'm me to see a daddy. I was just a good person, guys. I just... <laughs> I want to look beautiful. Mm-hmm. The moment my mom has said, Tutuangu wako wapi ni chukema mtu tutuangu, that hit me hard, man. That hit me hard. It hit me fucking hard. Because my mom... Okay, guys. <laughs> you see, she even shared a screenshot between Foyna Drosha and herself. What in the actual fuck is going on here, guys? Like, this is you blindsided me. We were friends. And then this babe, she looked hot. She looked drunk. She looked confused. And she looked like she, you know, she's battling. Do you know when, when you catch the, the vibe that this hand is probably battling something more? Than what, than, than what she's just, you know, letting out here. Because, uh, so she, she cried. Then she let out that statement. Then she was like, I'm about to trend. I don't give a fuck if I trend or not. I don't give a fuck. Let me trend. And then she said, um, I'm that person who can speak the truth. Then she went to bed crying. <laughs> I'm not sure. I'm not okay. And then five seconds later, she posts another story talking about how we will be okay regardless. We move regardless. Then a second later, she's having her makeup done. But you can see through that makeup, this babe was in so much pain. Like the eye bags underneath that makeup was just selling her out. It was like, I'm trying to be okay. I'm trying to show people that I don't care. You know, but... I will not be convinced. Brenda Jones is going through something more than just her being hurt by her lesbian love. Honestly, you guys. Honestly. I'm not... Listen. You can tell someone it is probably... It's probably... She's been disappointed too many times. And maybe she's that type of person who trusts blindly. You know those type of people who just tell you for me, you know, if I trust you, if I love you, if I'm committed to you, it is only you and I who are doing these things. Probably she's that kind of person. And then she was, I think she even put the, the, the whatever, the profile of the girlfriend or the ex, or I don't know who that is because who goes on social media, I managed to make us on a real life. And she's like, go for her because that's all she needs. And then when I think the makeup was almost done, the babe shows up and she looks like she wants to go back to cry. I said all these emotions, all these emotions. One person, one man army like this. Ah, I felt sorry for her. 
for some reason like because because you know when 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 you look at someone yeah and they've been hurt you know because of love love hey my pens you have my pens i'm a man you would not really you would not really understand but what i'm saying is brenda jones looked like she was battling more more <laughs> than what met the eye at this particular juncture it was like this was her tipping point do you know when when you sit with someone and they start narrating to you how messed up their life has been how you know these things of you know i trust people i i thought you know i thought this person had my back only for her to go come jiggy jiggy there with the one for Natasha and then for Natasha is also coming back here pretending like she has no idea what I'm talking about I've just been betrayed I've been hurt I they've done me that too many a times too many times different people have done me that and and you know what I looked at her and honestly speaking it looked like I I, I don't know guys I don't know it, it looks like she's going through something more than just the girlfriend cheating on her. Me, I'm telling you, because I was watching, and then when she went live, so someone uh, like sent me um, or whatever recording. I, I really didn't catch the live stream, but I followed on the stories, and she looked really distraught, really out of touch with reality. Do you know? Do you know? Let me just accept it by the Let me, let me, let me, let me just uh, be honest with you guys. You see these people online, and then maybe when we say these things, yeah, people might come for us, but it's the truth. You rarely take time to actually see the person for who they really are or what they're going through. Because everything, as I've said online here, it's a society of glamorizing things. Everything is so glamorous. It is, it is just like it's glamour, it's shiny. If someone cries like that, because even for her to be crying and then five seconds later she's like, I'll be okay. Then you're there sitting having your makeup done. I was so confused and I was like, Can you please, can you please just be a human being? Like, it's fine. We, your followers understand that you're going through something, you don't need to rush the process, you don't need to feel like you've embarrassed yourself. There is no need for you to feel like maybe I stay faking myself. It's, it's pointless. It's pointless. Yeah. But for me, like watching those snaps, I was like, this baby is going through something more than what she chooses to let out. And she just, I don't know. She looked out of touch. She looked hurt, betrayed, and like there's something more that's just disturbing her i don't know that's just what i picked don't come for me i mean i'm just saying from what i saw like because all those emotions bulked up in one i just wish she would have just married and i just told her that i'm not okay maybe there's this there's this there's this there's this there's this that i'm going through other than you just say that ah we'll be fine we move regardless but i hate that because Pain, pain is usually most often than not trivialized through such things. Yeah. Eh, so, Adi, what is this that them black dogs had just shocked? Hey, me, I'm like, eh, Adi, hey. Okay, so anyway, Hans Kana lets out this gem. It's a gem of a lifetime, a gem. And says that, you know, when that one was about to shoot, his video for Nanzaji, that new song, which I am, I'm, 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 I'm a fan of that song. It's a very nice song. So he says that, you know what? Actually, the first video vixen that had come to mind was Tanasha Dona, my baby mama, the one who gave me my, that, that, that a boy of mine, my twin, my twin, oh, and <laughs> they don't understand what happened in between here. But then uh, Dam of Platinums ended up flying another model from Dub, from Dub, from Dubai. So paying that model came and, and did the shoot. But Tanasha Dona was Dam of Platinums' first point of refuge. So it's either, guys are saying that it's either Tanasha was like, um, listen, I won't be available, or the money you're trying to pay me, Diamond, is not enough, or she had her own project that she was working on, or now Tanasha Donna's management has caught sense and they are saying, you cannot just be selling your brand for nothing. You, 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 
<laughs> you at least gent technically of course he started way higher than you but because you're on the same level it does not make sense again for you to go there just selling your brand for nothing but for me i was like so that means these people are still in talking terms like they're still talking behind the scenes but this time it was not just talking like come here let me smash you no it is i think they were talking in terms of business and if tanasha is the one who who's knocked them on platinum's call ah, la, 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 la. some of my other projects so how 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 do you expect for me to just be available at your every call and back call let's just hope that is what happened because if that is what happened but now oh bugalo oh bugalo oh bugalo but then that one like you know you got another person and i think like for hans kana to actually say this <laughs> it went in something he had even talked to them on platinum about and that one had given him the go ahead of course to go there and say it because hans kana is the one who shot the video oh ah, i do not know i don't understand but i was just like is it really you you when uh, 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 you've done a thing you've done a thing that <laughs> that has just left me speechless i can't even believe it i cannot believe it because can you imagine if if, if tanasha again featured as a video vixen in diamond platinum's video it will give her talking points but then again it will derail all the progress that this babe has made since january like we would be talking about her talking about now look at her see life you know she's here when i can have miss abubeto have been praised by in a cross talking about we have a connection and then i mean she goes back to down she did well i don't care probably it was the money that was not enough or something that did not just gel with Tanasha's management and Damon's management, but she did well. If she, listen, this is what I'm saying. If she's the one who said, I'm not doing this thing anymore, I'm not participating anymore, she did well for herself. I'm telling you the truth. I'm telling you the truth. It's, it's not even me at being here saying, oh, 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 oh. I'll be signing you. I'll be signing you. All this hard work she has put in bit Nigeria, you know, all the time that she probably wasted, she would have just gone back, like I don't know, 50 steps back, and then she'd just be known as a basic baby mama, then again, and not an artist in her own right. So be sure to hit notification, make sure that you subscribe so that you do not miss when we post and upload. Tell a friend, tell a friend, like, share, comment, do whatever you want, but just make sure that you are part of the coolest gang, the British gang. So see you again in the next video.